If you're looking for a cheap place to get your FIFA 15 coins and look no further, go to ufifa.com and use the code TVM to get yourself a discount. They also sell PSN and Microsoft points and subscriptions quite cheap as well. Link in the description. Cheap, fast and reliable. Go check them out. What is going on guys, TVM here, welcome back to another video, today I'm going to be talking to you about a web app glitch. Now an awful lot of you may not know about this, because I didn't know about this till this morning, and I'm pretty clued up on the glitches, as you may or may not know. Now if I didn't know about it, chances are most of you didn't know about it, I do apologise for those of you who do know about it, you may want to click off and just come back with another video. Um, so, on the web app, I don't know if it works on a console, but on the web app there is a way to get five of the same card in your club, and not on the tar transfer targets or transfer list. I actually mean in your club, ready to use, and you can switch them around. So you could do this for, I don't know, if you want to trade, and you want to uh, you want to try and stockpile them for the future, or and you don't want to take up your transfer list, uh, you know, slots, or you want to be able to switch them around. So if one gets a red card, you don't have to go and buy another one. He's already there in your club. You can just put him on. Do you know what I mean? That kind of thing. Now I'm going to show you an example. If I go over to my club, I've just been doing it with bronze players, but it does definitely work with gold ones. I've only been doing it with bronze just to test to see if it works. But there you can see we have one, two, three, four, and if we go to the next page, we have one there as well, which makes five. I have an I. Irish player waters here somewhere. One, two, three, four, and then another one on the other page makes five. Brilliant, yeah? Right, okay, so how do we do it then? So you've got to go onto the transfer market. You can do this with any player you want. If you want to go buy five Bentners for some strange reason, go do it. Buy five Legends if you're rich enough, whatever. I'm going to show you with a player who's really cheap because I don't really want to waste my coins doing this because I don't want to stockpile anyone. So I'm going to use uh, Khaled Nassar, Nasser, I don't know how to say his name, but either way. Search him up. There's going to be five of them on the market. And what you want to do is just click buy now. Okay. Now don't do anything. When you get to this screen, leave that completely. Just keep buying them, essentially. So you're going to keep going. Don't touch them when they give you the option to store in club or anything. Just keep going. You can only do this with a maximum of five, and I'll explain that in a second. And this is the fifth one. Right, once you've done number five, if you try and buy another one, it says that you cannot bid because there are five or more items in your unassigned pile. Now, what that means is in the top right here, you'll have a little unassigned pile. Come here, and you have five of them, okay? Now, you can't buy any more than five because it won't let you add any more in the unassigned pile, which is a shame. Now... You have three options, quick sell all, which you don't want to do because you've just spent money on them. You can store all in the club. Now what that will do, if you click it, it will only put one of them in the club and it will send four of them to the transfer list or say you have four left, what do you want to do with them? Ignore that, just click auto assign all and they disappear. Okay, so now what you want to do is you're going to go look in your club. We're going to go look for bronze players. We're going to have to shifty down here a little bit. He's quite low rated. Go past them and there they are, five of them in a row in your club ready to go. There's only four there. There's five there. There's, why is there only four? There's one there as well. That makes no sense. There's one there and there's one and there's four there. I don't know why it's done that but whatever they're there and then obviously the Waters is there next to him um, in, a, in a row. I don't quite understand why it left a gap between that one and those four. Um, but it has done. Either way, there's five in my club. So there we go. That is exactly how you do it. Like I said, you can do it with informs if you want. If you want to stockpile more than one player, it is very, very easy to do. I think it's quite nifty for a lot of people who may want to stockpile some informs if you want to do some investment trading. Um, or if you're worried about if you get an awful lot of red cards or injuries and don't want to have to go out and buy an injury card or wait a game for him to be done on the red card. Genius. I think, I think it's brilliant. I like it. Um, if you already knew about it, then I do apologize. You can test it on the console and let me know in the comment section if it works on the console. I'm not sure if there's an auto-assign all button in the unassigned items section of of the console version. But you, can, you guys can let me know in the comment section. Um, if you have enjoyed it and you found it useful, smack the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you have done so. Until the next time, thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.